Hey YouTubers, uh, Farm Boy Reef here. So today is Coral Fridays. Every Friday I bring a new coral and uh, talk about it. So today's coral, I got a nice uh, nice rock that has a lot of uh, zoos on it. I got a rock that has three different colors of zoos, nice colonies on there. We got pink, we got red, and we got yellow. So I have it right here, it's been acclimating for a little while, about an hour. Just been I'm just gonna show you while it's in the bag right now. That's a big uh, specimen of zoos right there. Got three different colors, it's pretty sweet. I don't know, it looks like there's like a, a shell in there. I'm gonna check that out, see what that could be. It looks pretty cool. So I'm just showing you guys in the bag right now. It's been acclimating for over an hour or more. So about an hour, just been adding a little bit of salt water to it now and then. Um, so it's soon ready to take out. So I'm gonna show you guys where I'm gonna place it. And the other thing I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna frag it out a bit too. I wanna to try to get all three different colors and put them on some uh, some coral plugs and uh, put them in down in the sump. So I'm gonna show you guys this process. I'm gonna show you where I'm gonna place it and show you the different colors that are on it as well. And uh, I wanted this thing I wanted to do, I wanted to do a shout out to, uh, to Pines 8411 out in Florida, Miami there. I went to my mailbox today and he sent me a, a nice t-shirt from uh, his club that he's in. It's the uh, Florida Marine Aquarium Society. I'll show you guys there, see that? That's a cool club, so I got a nice shirt from him. I wanted to say thanks a lot, man. I really appreciate that, and uh, fits great. So, moving on to the video here, we're gonna go downstairs, take this uh, coral down to the lab. Um, I wanna coral dip it, make sure we have no pests on it, make sure it's clean, and I'm gonna frag it out as well. Make that another episode, show you guys how to frag uh, Zeus. So, let's go down to the lab, guys, and get this started. So we made it down to the lab. Um, so we're gonna use the Revive Coral Dip for this one. So I got my water here ready. So it, what it says, it says you mix four capsules or 40 milliliters of Revive Perp 3.8 gallons of water. So I mixed up my, uh, I got my water here. So we're gonna add our four, our four capsules. One, two, three, four. So we got the four capsules in there. So we're just gonna give that a stir. Stir that up. So we're just gonna let that soak for a minute. So this this is our the specimen right here. It's a big chunk, like I got big hands and it fits both hands right here. Um, I picked this up for uh, $60 and it's got three different colors on here. It's pretty sweet. So we're gonna coral dip this and see what kind of pests and creatures we get off of it before we put it in the display tank. And like my other videos, I'm going to put it for another uh, five minutes longer than I usually do. Because they, they suggest to put it in here for 15 minutes. So we're going to do 20 minutes and let it soak longer. All right, guys. So I'm going to let this, I'm going to put this in here and we'll see what comes off. So I got the, I got the coral right now and the coral dip. Just remember, always wear your safety glasses when you're working with really any coral, especially zoos. They, uh, if you ever get some of their juice on your fingers and you touch your eyes, you know, you could go blind or just lose sight at all so always wear them they're very poisonous one of the most poisonous uh, corals in the in the ocean as well um, so make sure always wear your safety glasses and gloves all right guys so we'll get these put on and we're gonna see what what's going on in here right now I can see some little uh, some little critters uh, coming out of the coral right now there's a few pests so we're gonna check this out do a little shout out for Florida Marine uh, Aquarium Society. My new shirt there from uh, Pines 8411. That's his club. Really appreciate the shirt, man. Really like it. It's great. And uh, I just want to do a shout out to you guys. Pretty nice he is. All right, so let's. We're gonna check out the coral right now. Got safety glasses and got gloves on because it's very poisonous and you don't want to get squirt in the eye or just anything on your fingers and touch or your mouth. So let's get started, hey guys. So I got the the specimen here. So since I put it in the in the coral dip here in the revive. We got one little uh, bristle starfish, uh, serpent style, and we got uh, just a little mysis shrimp going on here. So let's just agitate this a little bit. Um, we're gonna just gonna move it around a little bit, see if we can get anything else coming off. And the best thing is try not to bruise uh, your zoos too much. So I'm gonna leave this in here for 20 minutes and see if we get any other little critters coming off. But you can see how populated this colony is. It looks really good. Show you guys. So there you go. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty co good colon colony going on here. So I got some uh, yellow, some pinks, and some reds. So that you know, there's not too many pests coming off there right now. But we're gonna leave it in a little bit longer. Um, if you look, where is that? Right in there. See that? Looks like a little muscle. So let's put this back in here, and uh, we're just gonna agitate this a little bit more and see if we get anything else to come off. 
guys, so the coral's been in there for 20 minutes now. Um, I feel I feel comfortable that it's good to go. It's gonna be pest free. There's just a few little uh, like serpent sea stars we had in here. That's not too bad, and a couple uh, mice's shrimp. That's about it. So I'm just gonna clean this up. I'm gonna rinse it off with some of my aquarium water. Uh, I don't want to put it right in my tank when it's just right out of the solution here. So I'm just gonna rinse it all up, and then we'll take it upstairs. We'll put it in a display tank. Show you where I'm gonna put it and where I want the colony to grow. Um, a few, uh, actually, a few of the zoos fell off, so I'm gonna coral frag those onto plugs and uh, show you guys a little video on that. And so let's go upstairs. All right guys, so just made it upstairs to the, to the display tank, just come from the lab. So I got the zoos in the tank, I got them mounted. I'm gonna show you where I mounted them. I end up, uh, had a couple extra frags kicking around, so I glued them to a few different spots here up on the, the cliff. And I mounted the other, uh, the whole zoo rock with a bit of putty to hold that one. So I'm gonna show you guys. So right now I'm just gonna use my reef link and use my iPhone, and I'm gonna turn my blues on. You can see a little bit of the white at the bottom there. It's, uh, it's really bright. So I'm just gonna turn them right now. Let's turn down to our blues. So we'll turn our reds down, our greens, and our whites. So there we go. So now we got all the blue blue lights on. So that, there we go, guys. Got the blue lights on. I'm gonna show you. I got the zoos right now, and they're mounting that. So we got the blues on. I shut the light off in the room. So I'm gonna do some close-ups, show you the three different colors we got of zoos going on here, and uh, we'll check them out. All right, guys. So there's the specimen rock, the zoo rock, three different colors. So right now, I'm gonna try to dial these in for you guys. Just use the blues to see if we can. A few of the polyps are closed up right now, but let's see what we can get. So I'm just going to turn my reds down using my reef link and my iPhone. Turn my radions, you can turn the greens down. Start turning the cool whites down. You can see some of the polyps that are starting to pop there now. So let's start dialing the, the blues in. So now you can see some of the pinks in there. It's pretty cool. I wish the fish would stop going back and forth. So there's some more of the polyps. They're still closed up a little bit right now, but I just really want to show you guys. But you can see the different colors in there. We got our uh, little bit of greens, yellows, and pinks, and we call them red. Alright, so let's move on to the other little frag to show you guys. Um, it's over here. So here's another little bit of the frag that broke off the bigger rock. So I just actually just took the Ecotech glue and glued this right to the rock itself. So I'm just going to try to dial in my uh, reef link again and see if we can see some of these colors pop. So let's shut, let's shut the reds down, shut the greens, cool whites, start slowly dialing the blues down a little bit. So there you go, they really pop. And these ones actually have red in the center with uh, like a neon yellowish around the edges. Let's try to get it down to like 5%. So those are closer, they're pretty nice. So that's the, that's the coral for Coral Fridays this week. The Nassau Tang, he likes to get right in, involved in the in all the videos. So there you go. That's at 55% just blue. Dial up 75%. So let's bring everything back up. Let's bring the cool whites back up. Let's bring the greens and the reds and all the whites. So there we go, guys. The other thing I wanted to show you, remember uh, the other last Friday I showed you the cans I got, the Lemon Burst? Let's check them under just the, the blues. So I'm just going to dial down the reds, the greens, the cool whites. So look at that. Is it ever popping, eh? Yeah, these radians, I really like them. You really get the colors popping. I just want to show you that, that e can. So that's Coral Friday guys, it's a zoo rock we did, we've got three different colors. Um, I just want to share that with you guys, so I hope you guys really like this episode, and uh, please subscribe and hit the like button, and uh, we should turn the brights back on. So if you have your reef link and you got your radions, you can use it on your phone. So let's turn this back up guys. Let's turn on our blues, let's 
turn on our cool whites, our greens, and our reds. There she's back up and going. The sand's pretty bright, you guys can notice. All right, guys, so thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next Coral Friday. Thanks, guys. Bye.